What's poppin' game, man? We in this motherfucker. Y'all already know, man. We finna go ahead and kick it off with a nice one, man. But how everybody day going so far? You know what I'm saying? Mine, I've been calling. Comment on the bottom. Let me know how about yours was. I mean, let me know how about your day was. You feel me? Whatever the fuck. But yeah. We gone. I'm gone. Y'all have a nice Halloween. You feel me? Go crazy. But don't go too crazy. And yeah, bro. Do your shit. Be responsible. Oh, yeah, we got us a um, little, I think I like a little touch, a truck driver. I'm still going to say touch. A truck driver, you feel me? We got some shit called on cam, a couple of them, so we finna see what this shit about. In February of 2015, this pair of truck drivers was driving down the highway when a white truck quickly sped up to them got in front of them and slowed down, forcing them to stop their truck altogether. They thought the man inside was trying to tell them something, like their brake lights weren't working or something, so they pulled to the side of the road. But once they stopped, no one got out of the white truck. It circled the two truckers and stopped right next to them, even blocking oncoming traffic at times. The person inside could now clearly be seen, but he just sits there, staring at them. They worried the man had a gun. I was just for the show, like, damn. Are you even see somebody in that motherfucker? That motherfucker just hell no. Nah, why y'all stopping in the middle of the fucking road? Anyway, like, how y'all even doing on highway? I'm inside, but I don't even see no cars sliding by. You feel me? Like, how the nigga got in the car and do all of that shit? <laughs> but this causes the white pickup to pull right in front of them. Bro, I had to, you feel me? I would have just pushed off, bro. On oh, mama's. They tweaking. Oh, me. Like, well, what's the point of shit sitting there? Nigga ain't talking about shit. He just a west. Apparently, he is a strange motherfucker. He a weirdo. <laughs> Does he think you cut him off or something? I don't understand this shit, man. I don't understand this shit, man. I guess they disturb me. Bro, apparently the brother, boy, them boys, they, they were in that car, bro. It's, it's hot. He's hot. This is all what it is, man. He, he fucked up right now. He, he feel me? He, and nigga, I should've just kept pushing. I would've kept pushing, shit. Yeah. Truck drivers are forced to back up to get around. They try to record the license plate, but it's not entirely visible. After a few seconds of just sitting there, the white pickup backs up to be in line with the truck. The truck drivers take this opportunity to try and drive away. Damn, hey man. Yeah, see, I would have had to ban. You should have been done that. As they drive off, should have been done that, bro. Trailer in what can only be assumed an attempt to get them to stop. But they keep going and eventually lose the white pickup. A bit further down the road, they park and wait for police to arrive. When they did, they started a search and after a while found the white pickup on the side of the road a bit further down. They detained the man inside and after seeing the video, arrested him. Police later determined the man was not in his right mind and the outcome could have easily been worse than it was. Told you. 
I fucking told y'all niggas, man. Come on, bro. I fucking told y'all niggas, man. Hey, bro, bro, no, bro. It's cool, it's cool, bro. I know it, bro. I told you, bro. I would have kept pushing, bro. My mama was like, that nigga's real clearly, bro, not here, bro. That nigga here, bro, but that nigga not here, bro. Like, nah, bro. Hell, nah, bro. I told y'all. This be on me. See what this next one this talking about, man. Bro. On July 29th, 2016. The truck is in Calais, a city in France that overlooks the narrowest point in the English Channel. It's headed for a port which will take it over the channel to the UK. As it continues on the road, the truck in front of it suddenly breaks, causing the truck with. Oh, the dash cam to lay on the horn. Shortly after, multiple men with flashlights appear on the road, throwing rocks at the truck, trying to get it to stop. They even use tree branches as makeshift roadblocks. Damn, damn. What the fuck going on? Hey, y'all seen that? I seen that. That was quick, though. It wasn't quick. Wait, oh, my, it's gonna come up. Y'all gonna see some shit. Well. What the fuck wrong? What the fuck, bro? Okay, 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 okay. They tweaking. Hey, they're tweaking, bro. What's wrong with people, bro? Like, what the fuck is y'all even doing outside at night? I don't know, trying to chop some up in the trees now. We're trying to get trees out the way, bro. Somebody, they apparently, bro, they got a job for people for like that, bro. Niggas gonna clean that shit up, bro. Stop trying to be a good citizen, bro. Y'all, this, this shit don't work all the time, bro. You're not gonna get points for that, my nigga. Be cool. Sit down, bro. Just chill. It's not that serious, bro. Niggas said they out here trying to get a medal and shit. The truck smashed through the tree branches. Not I don't want a medal so bad. Key to the city and shit. Look at that. The video on the throw rocks at the windows of trucks, stand in the road, on an attempt to get trucks to stop. If they're successful, they'll use different weapons to threaten truck drivers into starting them on the border. Reports of these occurrences, both successful and unsuccessful, come in somewhat frequently. Many other dash cams on trucks driving through the same area have captured similar occurrences. This one shows a hijacking attempt with more people involved. So y'all that trying to hijack some. Ooh, damn, they hella deep with it. Okay, okay, I see what y'all saying. And they going, they trying to get, yeah, on my mama's hold that way, bro. What? They finna finesse your shit, nigga ain't get across that motherfucker on oh, my mama, no questions. Nigga, you see how deep them niggas is, too, oh, boy? Hey, that nigga locking his doors, that nigga ain't <laughs> Them bitches ain't gonna work, nigga. It's like a hundred of them motherfuckers, nigga. This bitch, nigga. Like some shadow claws out there, deep in a motherfucker, no cap. I want to gas that bitch, bro. I am not capping, bro. I'm finna hit all y'all bitch ass niggas. Get the fuck out of my way, nigga. The fuck, nigga. Oh, my <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 I'm like, hey, nigga, they got in front of me, nigga. They got in front of me, nigga. It ain't was deep, nigga. Fuck, nigga. Oh, my God. Fuck, man, what? Hey, yeah, I believe these attempts let me occurred between 12 and 6 a.m. Shit, man. Trade me seats with that, nigga. To fully eradicate the issue for years. In 2012, Years. Hurricane Ida, Bro, God, extremely destructive damn. Category 4 hurricane, hit the state of Louisiana. It was the second most powerful hurricane recorded to have done so. It quickly devastated the southernmost port of Louisiana as it moved upwards further into the U.S. The hurricane created multiple tornadoes as it did so. This semi-truck would find itself in the middle of one of them, all of which was caught on its dash cam. It happened in Horsham, Pennsylvania. The truck hey, stops and we have it on tornadoes, bro. Green, the driver decides to stay put. Don't be shit, though, bro. The winds quickly begin picking up. 
We be eating on motherfuckers for real, for real, though, huh, Oklahoma? We be out there. Continues to be forced nah, to bro, we, really, we, got to, we really be getting along with the motherfuckers, for real, for real, bro. You just gotta know what to do, bro. For real. See that motherfucker? That nigga in that bitch, folks. Ooh, ooh, to push the truck ooh. Over. The dash cam falls out of place, revealing the driver still being held in his seat from his seatbelt. Almost immediately after falling over, a man driving a van in front of the truck turned around and went over to help. The truck driver was assisted out of his truck, where the two men then ran for cover in a nearby building. The truck driver made it out with only minor injuries. Damn, hold on, damn, for real, Oh, shit, that shit, wow, bro. We're gonna do a part two on this motherfucker, man. Let's go.